is a beautiful state and second smallest state of India where it lies in 27.5 degree north and 88.5 degree east and has total area of about 7096 square kilometer. Our state has varied culture and tradition. Our state holds mountain soil and has subtropical coniferous forest and tropical vegetation. Tropical wet climate is what we bear in our state where the annual rainfall is 3736.8 mm whereas the altitude is 5200 feet above sea level as gazing the headquarter of west district where our school is situated the total area of our school is 24507.2 meters square whereas gazing has subalpine vegetation environment has restricted space for our observation, we have selected our school premises itself. Our school is located with an altitude of 5200 meter above sea level and it comes under subtropical pine forest. We made a team of 5 students and started to observe each activities of all the living organisms individually for about 20 minutes. We saw many living creatures like birds, bees, butterflies, snails, and snakes, spiders, lizards, grasshopper, beetles, frog, etc. We have observed many activities like moving of all the tiny insects, building their homes like ants, sp spiders weaving their waves, and butterflies attracted to gardens and fields that offer a variety of flowering vegetation. We saw many birds visit flower for food, extracting nectar and eating worms. Even we have found the seals of the snake and we measure it was 5 feet long. Now we have learned that each species are interlinked and interdependent on each other. We have learned that we should conserve a particular species in danger of existence. Knowledge of a place of that species in an ecosystem is vital. For this activity, first we pluck different types of leaves from our school premises. These leaves were laid on a table in order to note down the name. So the leaves were of the fruit tree, flowering plants, medicinal plants and some common plants. Leaves were like rose leaf, guava leaf, fire plants leaf, gooseberry leaves, etc. Now as the activity started, we brought a chart and kept the leaves in a row maintaining small gaps between them. These leaves were laid on a chart after chatting down their name. They were covered by charts and then by a pile of hardwood. They were then left for few days, so their name and their services were jotted down along with their relationship with other organisms. Example, Leaf of Tulsi has medicinal values and used by human beings. At last what we came to know is the value of each plant helped us understand its importance and relation with one another. Leaf Manchures This activity was one of the most interesting one as we first took a bucket as a container then we collected different types of leaves dry and fresh both. Mixed it with the soil of our surrounding, then added it in the bucket and covered it with leaf. After that, left it for 10 days and we made it upside down. Left our observation again.
After 10 days later, we brought the leaves and observed it under a microscope. Not only that, first when we took its weight, it was exactly 4.300 gram and later on after decomposition, it was 4.100 gram. We also observed the eggs of organisms like butterfly, but the pH value of the soil was neutral, nor acidic, neither basic. What we learn is even after the plants shed their leaves, these leaves is beneficial for the earth. They become the manure and the changes takes place by the help of decomposers organisms. Though the organisms may not be visible to our naked eyes, but has a vital role to play. Uh, we had interview with different people like the forest rangers, fishermen and farmer where they talked about the production and that being compared to past many years and these recent days where the changes had been brought by the climate and also its effect on their production. As being a forest guard, I have a responsibility to put on the head. Just I have a field staff, I have a field major, rest of the zone, I'm a ranger, block officers, so I'm a little bit of a zone. 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 Try going right, so I am best in the business world. So, I am happy. Then, so verify also. So, sano bande sano look. I am like cut no time. Five feet bande. Palm ko look. I am like ten or twelve no cut no time. Fire ko time. Just the other topic. Our your winter on the side. Third time ma our winter. Our like zada sorry ko time ma. Cause zana like smoking or record din sa. Zada suka I am cigarette or we got a fire din sa. Much is very bad. So, tio tio so you topic ko I am go ero. Forest land tiro, not only private holding, but even tiro, ag holding, so border, border, so reserve forest tiro, but private holding, but even time is more. Tiro time much, all the time is busy also. Rat is suit the time, but you go to the point, you know, I'm like, 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 I'm जंगल तीर अपनी बायाल थी हो, जहीं तहीं भून थी हो, तेज कारण लगा दर कितनी त्यो किटान आज लाख है ना, अने कम ती मात्रा में लाख थी, देरे ही साल समन स्थाई रहने थी ऑनलाइन चेयरू, पर आइले जहीं किटान और साथी ने ज्यादा बाई को कारण लगा दर करी, ऑनलाइन चेयरू देरे लामो समय समर राना सकते ह पहला बंदा चाहिए लेकिन तेरे रोक आ रुपाई दियो, भाई लेगो था। पानी को तापन में होता है। जति मास है ना ये चाहिए लेकिन समझ से अगर तापन से जति तुम ना ये वाला ये वाला सीमेंटेड टैंकी ले जाए, तापन से एकदम घाटे रह गए हो। चले करा वो अलग तो वाली कुछ प्रोडक्शन करते हो एक नो करियो रख काई में मार्च की अपनों चांस होने और यो अलग तो जति काम क्लाइमेट काम लाए के राम लो मार्च अगर लाए तो अलग पानी तातो चाहिए नहीं तो पानी से कुत्ते के तातो चाहिए सब बंदा करी जाए ये ले 20 परसेंट 23 समन Card game. For this game, we took some hard board, glue, scissor, scale, and the picture paper as we were provided. We applied glue in the paper and pasted it on the hard paper. According to the line margin, 
we took the shape of single card. Similarly, all the cards were in perfect order. To play this game, we took four students each in one turn, where all students played in turn. They had to follow the rules and regulation. As the first round got over, they calculated their points and another four students had to continue the game. It went on and on. So finally we declared a winner, where there was a prize, not any solid object, but a pile of knowledge. Knowledge about ecosystem, life of organism, importance of plants and connection among one another. Terrarium. The, the type of terrarium we prepared was of tropical habitat. First we brought one container and then collected soil, pickles, charcoal, dried leaf manure. according to the instruction and then lastly we put some different kinds of insect and sowed the seed of lentils. We could observe that the organisms that we put inside the terrarium, firstly they tried to escape. Grasshopper was jumping, spider tried to climb up. Likewise, we checked them each week and we could slowly notice that they adapted to the habitat. Spider was building their way, larva digging their hole. And of course, some organisms could not survive because they are somewhere predator and some prey. In this whole process, I think water is most important element. We should maintain the balance of water as the life started from water and if not maintained properly, it will be the reason of the end of life. We learned many things like making and absorbing this terrarium. We learned that the role of animals in ecosystem cannot be ignored as they have linked the food chain or food way. They have to suffer while changing their habitat. We were able to know about the ecosystem and how it should be maintained, food chain, water and humidity. For our observation, we have taken an example of a man-made wound. As we are here observing this pond, uh, this is a rainwater pond. Uh, all the water here has been collected by the rainfall and the length of this pond is about 80 meters long and its depth at the midpoint is all about uh, 4 feet and Ages, like it has approx about uh, the depth is almost about two feet, and there are many different types of insects as well as other living organisms. The different types of dragonfly over here, different species of dragonfly, and nowadays, as you can see, it's a rainy season and they are doing fertilization. So we saw how they fertilize and how they produce eggs. We have observed many living organisms sharing the same habitat. Many living organisms like frog, tiny insects, small worms, dragonflies, fish and other swamp creatures. All these living things have certain common characteristics. They need food, they respire and excrete, respond to their environment, reproduce, grow and show movement. We have observed that all plants, animals and microorganisms together constitute biotic component. <laughs>